Are you not getting free bits on Twitch? Well, we're gonna discuss some of the reasons why you aren't getting those bits and how you could possibly get them. So make sure that you stay tuned to today's video. Cause this video is for you. <laughs> I'm Dale and I'm Walt and this is live streaming tech and if you want to learn a little bit more about live streaming online be it on Twitch YouTube Facebook and whatnot make sure that you subscribe to this channel and turn your bell notification on so you don't miss a single video if you haven't watched our past video on how to get free bits on Twitch by watching ads click this card above but we want to discuss why some of the reasons why you might not be getting free bits on Twitch by watching ads. And we can give you a couple of potential solutions, so make sure you stick around to the end so you know exactly why you aren't getting any of the ads and how you can possibly get some type of a solution. So let's just start it out with how ads function. Now I can say as an advertiser, I've used YouTube on a number of occasions and even Facebook, and how ads work is an advertiser will come to the platform so they are able to serve, say, their commercial or their ad, if you will, to you now with ads you can actually pick a specific audience who you want to have it served to because obviously you don't want to be having ads for a lawnmower for eight-year-old kids okay right. and likewise you don't want to be serving play-doh ads over to a senior citizen it just doesn't make sense so that's why and you need to kind of understand not all the time are some of the ads are going to work out for some people so just bear that in mind every now and then when you're kind of going i don't understand this my brother got these ads but i didn't get them well there's a good chance that they're specifically targeting that audience for a good reason for instance i have a dog my brother has a cat so eventually through them seeing cookies where we visit on the websites uh, this and that they're going to figure out that i have a dog and he has a cat so does it make sense for an advertiser to target dale for dog food and me for cat food no it doesn't it'd be the opposite way around so the next issue that uh, a lot of people aren't aware of and we tried to make it clear in our past video once again if you didn't click that card up there, you can go back and hit our playlist and uh, look at the uh, video that we did on how to get free bits by watching ads. The thing is, is that it is blocked per region. Now, when the mobile was out, uh, it was more than the United States. Now that they've done away with the Twitch mobile, and yes, unfortunately, you can no longer earn bits by watching ads on your mobile device. You have to use the desktop browser it is only for the United States only. And even in some parts of the United States, say you live out in the boonies, you're more likely probably not gonna see ads because they're not targeting you. They're gonna target more population dense areas. I know what you're probably thinking. There's some of you out there that think, okay, there is some solutions that you heard so-and-so try, or maybe someone said something inside a comment or inside a Twitch chat of some sort. We wanna talk about some of the solutions you shouldn't do. And I've even made this mistake by saying this in the comments. Now, the first thing you shouldn't do is don't try to circumvent the system and then win any way, shape, and form. I know there's a lot of people out there say, well, I live overseas, I use a VPN that's based in the United States and therefore I can watch bits. You're gonna have to make your own decision on that and I would probably recommend against it because for some reason, it breaks Twitch's terms of service when it comes to getting these ads because it's basically lying about where you're located in the world. So therefore, think about it this way. We're paying as advertisers to serve people and we're wanting to only serve US customers on Twitch, but yet we have people over, say, in Czechoslovakia using VPNs pretending to be in New York City. Now, I'm not saying that's the reason why they're using VPN. Maybe they're a streamer like myself and use a VPN for my own protection. So, I mean, that could be one of the issues. The second thing is, is do not make alt accounts. I have actually, have recommended this to people to try to figure out whether they were being, they said, hey, I, Walt, I live in the United States, I'm not getting ads, and I'm like, make an alt account. Actually, I have gone in and read the terms of service when it comes to watching ads for free bits on Twitch, and they do not recommend against that, or recommend against it, is because that people then were starting to abuse it. They would make the alt account and then they would earn bits on it and then 
cheer to their own channel yeah. and that will get you banned permanently off of Twitch. So not only the alt account, but the channel that is being cheered to as well because it's underneath the same IP. Um, and they do investigate that. Now, for some reason, if you get locked out of your account or some reason you know, or another, you can no longer get in your account, I recommend emailing Twitch to try to get back in that account before you make an alt account because there's nothing worse than making an alt account just because you forgot a password and them seeing you watching and earning free bits by watching ads and next thing you know you're banned because they think that you're trying to circumvent the system. Yeah, I'll let you know that as the parent company Amazon, they, I use their platform for many, many different operations as a business. I'm gonna tell you that they are very weary of people trying to game or manipulate the system. So. You may be getting away with some of these things right now, but they will start to close those loopholes up. So I would advise that you don't try to trick the system. And just because they don't catch you red-handed doesn't mean they can't go back six months from when you actually did it and go back and ban you for that breaking of terms of service. Exactly. So now that we've kind of got all the doom and gloom out of the way, there is clearly some type of a solution, obviously, because people want to get some bits, right, man? Correct. So let's make sure we can kind of give them the goods because there are some pretty practical ways that you can get the bits if you aren't currently getting them. And the first thing is, is if you do live in the United States and for some reason you think you're not being served up bit, so when you open that browser and you go to click that button that says watch ad for free bits, a lot of times a lot of people will see that notification that will say try back again. That's literally what it means, try back again later. I know my brother-in-law, he went a good two solid months where it was grayed out and it told, kept telling him to try back again and it frustrated him. And lo and behold, two months later, it actually was open again. The thing also I found is that the time of the day makes a big difference. You have to remember these advertisers only pay for so many views. So for instance, and we're gonna, this is obviously small scale, but say an advertiser gets on Twitch and they pay for a hundred views of their ads. Well, if they start that at such and such time in the morning and you get on Twitch later in the afternoon, regardless of what time zone you're in, those ads have already been used up and those bits have already been given out. So in other words, there is a cap on these advertisements. Okay, so this is a pretty interesting one. This is one that actually he shared with me was uh, actually posting on Reddit because it seems that Twitch is very receptive to feedback and suggestions over there. So uh, Reddit goes a little bit above my head. How does that work? Um, you will see posts on Reddit and literally, uh, you can get on there right now and see a post that says uh, not getting free bits for watching ads. Get on there and in a polite way, basically say where you're located in the world and that you would love if Twitch would serve up ads for your area. At the end of the day, again, it's an Amazon owned company and they're very customer centric. So if there's enough noise coming from you, the viewers of the Twitch content, they're going to listen. And here's the beauty of it is, it's not their ad dollars. It's not Amazon's ad dollars, it's the other one. So if they know that this is something that the viewers want, they're gonna figure out a way to deliver those ads to you. So you gotta make just a little bit of noise. Uh, by the way, this is just, it's, this is simple solutions. And obviously, I know there are probably some more, so if you know some solutions, we definitely wanna hear from you in the comments below. And if you want to know exactly how to get free bits by watching ads, we actually have a video right up here. You're gonna take a look at that. We will see you on over there. And hold on a second, wait. Over here, there's one where you can earn free bits without watching ads. Go check that video out.